Well, I was going to do a reaction video to the Sonic movie, but it just came out. Well, it actually came out a few days ago, but I waited still. That uh, the director decided, after all the backlash that he got from that original trailer, that he would change the design for Sonic. Good. Sonic's character design is fine. It's perfect. The best thing about Sonic's design is that he doesn't look like a hedgehog. He looks like Sonic. He's so His design is so iconic and perfect, in fact, that any alteration will inevitably send fans and non-fans alike into a fervor. Remember Sonic Boom? In fact, Sonic has only been redesigned twice. And at least one of those two times was met with huge amounts of criticism. The problem with the movie's original take on his design, in my opinion, is that he looks a lot more like a primate than the ambiguous blue blur that we call a hedgehog. The human-like proportions, the teeth, the hands, it's a new, it's, he's basically, basically an ape. Basically, he's, he's a new species of ape. But now, since they're changing it, it'll be jarring for other reasons, I think. If they model Sonic after his in-game look, then you'll want the voice to match, right? He can't look too much like a video game, like the video game Sonic, or they'll have to get his voice actor. I mean, the, with the way he looked in the um, in the trailer, I could have expected, I could have been fine, and ex I, well, I could have expected and been fine with any voice that came out of that mouth. Anything he could have sounded like anything because he just he doesn't look like Sonic, so he can sound. I, I have I have no expectation of what he should sound like, but the closer they move his design into the territory of actual Sonic the more problematic that it will be that he doesn't sound like his in he doesn't sound like Sonic, you know? So if they change him too much, then you'll have the issue of the voice, I think. I I, I mean, I listened to the trailer, he kind of sounds like he's doing an imitation of Roger Craig Smith, who's doing an inc who's doing an imitation of uh Jason Griff, who's doing an inc you know, you know, on and on. But I think it'll be, it, it's off enough that it would sound a little too jarring, I think, if you put it, if if they kept that voice for the movie. That's just my take. What do you guys think? 